Hi guys, Dr. Victoria Skirbo here, speaking to you from the Seeds of Transformation Healing Center in Wareham, Massachusetts. And uh, I want to talk about the Green New Deal today. Um, I saw a video um, that was, uh, I think, written by and narrated by uh, Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez about the New, New Deal. It was uh, actually beautiful artwork uh, for it, if you get a chance to see it. Um, I'm sure you could just find it on YouTube or find it on Facebook. I saw it on Facebook. And uh, quite frankly, it's sort of like, a, uh, it's, it's a little bit of a wet dream for me, <laughs> what she was talking about. Oh, the idea of, you know, being kind to the earth and being kind to each other and living in harmony and, you know, doing, uh, you know, living in harmony instead of all this, 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 anger and rage and corruption and ugh, and utilization and, and abuse um yeah i mean why not right why not so i wanted to do a reading on it and see um you know what is the what's the possibility for this you know what's the possibility for this so i'm just i'm just gonna put the cards up um as i pick them i don't have it set up for you to see me uh you know spread them out but we'll just go card by card. And I'll tell you what, what you know, where the card is in the, uh, in the reading. I'll do the Celtic cross. That's I seem to always do. Okay, so the immediate environment around the Green New Deal, okay? We have the Page of Cups. And so this is a, a message, a message of hope. Um, it is in its uh, infancy. There is a sense of infancy here. There's a sense of maybe naivete here. Um, one of the things that um, about the pages in general and then uh, the page of cups in specific, pages are always about the beginning of something, start of something, um, something that's not particularly mature. And yet I feel as though when you're dealing with cups, um, you know, out of the mouth of babes kind of feeling there, right? So there is this sense of, you know, um, the, a purity of heart. Uh, so I think that this is coming from that place. And this is not just something that Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez came up with. Um, this is something that Bernie Sanders has been talking about. Her co-sponsor in the Senate was uh, Ed Markey, my senator, proud to say, from Massachusetts. So uh, it's not just her thing, but she has become the face of it, as she has become the face of many, of anything that seems to be new and changing, and and um, and there, you know, f for the people. And depending on your point of view, it depends on how you see that to be either something good or something a, a problem. So let's see what's crossing the, the Green New Deal. Um. Okay, so we have the Two of Wands here. The Two of Wands is a, uh, a card of communication, really. In this case, it's sort of uh, taking, taking. it's also a, a card of commerce. So how do we make it uh, commercially, perhaps really commercially successful? Uh, but there is this sense of uh, looking at the world from a larger perspective and, um, and sort of putting out... I, you know, it's interesting because a lot of the technology for the green stuff is coming from places like China. So uh, this this not will would not only be a boom for us, but it would also probably be a boom for China as well. Um, but the challenge is how do you how do you spread the word? Number one, how do you communicate it in such a way that people feel like it's to their benefit? Let's see what's at the root of it. Okay, we have the five of um, cups. So at the root of this is sorrow over what we've lost, um, species we've lost, uh, uh, environments, um, um, whole uh, ecosystems that have been lost. And we can't focus on what's been lost. We need to see what we still have, what's still here for us. And that's what this card suggests. And I think that's, in a way, what the Green New Deal is doing. Let's see in the past. Okay, in the past we have money. I feel like this is money blocking that. Let's see what's in the sky. OK, 
Okay, we have the moon. There's a lot of emotions around this, a lot of emotions. Um, there's, there's a lot of sense of, uh, you know, the moon can be, uh, can be the need for security. It, it, like in astrology, the moon is the need for security. Uh, and for some, this could be um, a sense of insecurity. But the moon is also, uh, there's a lot of emotional ups and downs with this. So this is an emotional subject. And so there's a, there's a variety of feeling about this, you know, between all levels of, of peoples, I guess. Let's see the immediate future for the Green New Deal. Okay, oops. Cakes. Sorry. Uh, we got the Seven of, of uh, Pentacles. And so this is about uh, doing the work that's necessary, uh, applying yourself, and figuring out what you need to do. It's not quite uh, ready for prime time. But there's still some things that have to be figured out. Um, but there's a level of understanding that we need to have around resources and an understanding around monies and an understanding around um, that there is a limitation to a certain extent of resources if we continue to utilize the resources the way we are now. Um, this is how it's seen from the outside. Uh, there's some um, skepticism. Okay, well, that's pretty pretty true um, the domestic situation okay this is about a whole new way of being doing living and people know it um, hopes and fears um, people are afraid of their security even though you know sometimes um, the, the the chance of the change um, is scarier even though things aren't really great and this, of course, could be the moneyed few as well. And so they're concerned about it. They're concerned about it. Let's see the outcome. Okay, we have the Queen of Swords. Doesn't she look like Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez? Isn't that funny? The Queen of Swords is a Libra card, and I believe that Alexandria is a Libra. So she continues to be the face. But we have here um, the little butterfly here. So that's the butterfly of transformation. So this is uh, this is about people willing to fight for this. And so it's going to depend on who's willing to fight for it. And certainly she is. Let's see if we can pull a major arcana. We get the king of pentacles. The knight of pentacles. And this, the five of pentacles. So that's all issues around money. Let's see what's underneath. We have the temperance card. Which is um, the, the card of healing. And it also means that we can't get up. We can't get caught up in the extremes. And so for the most part. This is, um, this is a good plan. And, um, I mean, there is nothing neg really negative about this. Um, it's something that's going to take time to develop. It's going to take time to, to work it out. But ultimately, um, if people are willing to fight for it, we can manifest it. We definitely can manifest it. So that's kind of um, exciting. And then ultimately, um, it's a healing process. It's a healing process for us. So, great news. <laughs> Okay, I hope you enjoyed that, that uh, reading. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you again soon. Bye.